he you picked up. Listen, I'm really sorry, love, but you know you said you went to bed, but you couldn't sleep. You're so sweet. I really hope I didn't wake you. No, you couldn't sleep either. I'm sorry. I don't know. I guess there's just a lot on my mind with everything going on right now. I did try everything, I promise, before I called you. You know, everything you said, I tried a warm glass of milk. I have a whole pile of stuff here. Like, I really tried everything, I promise. I just, we needed to talk to you. You make me feel better and you help with my anxiety. I'm glad I can help you too. I hate that we haven't, like, physically seen each other in such a long time. It's been really hard. I mean, don't get me wrong, I know it's the right thing, and we want to keep everybody safe and healthy. I just can't wait to see you in person again and give you a big hug. You know, it's been really rough. At least now we can FaceTime each other. Since I got my phone fixed. <laughs> Bad time, right? Yeah, I have it set up on my TV stand in front of my bed. Yeah, it's kind of propped up a little bad, so I hope it doesn't fall. <laughs> if it randomly crashes, I swear I'm okay. <laughs> you know, it's really late, and I still feel like I'm wide awake. My brain is, like, racing right now. I did try everything you told me to, though. I tried the melatonin vitamins. Yeah, they helped a little bit. They made me feel like a little sleepy, a little groggy, but not enough to stop my racing thoughts, so didn't really help. I tried the warm glass of milk and tea. I even got myself a little glass of wine. And you know I hate drinking alone, so it shows you I really tried to not wake you up. You're too sweet. I know you don't care, but I know you're really busy and working from home, and I just feel bad. You're so sweet. I miss you so much. Stop. I know we talk all the time, but I just miss being with you in person. I know. You're just trying to lighten the mood. You miss me too. Even if we're just being boring and watching TV. I welcome those kind of dates right now. They're so comforting. Hopefully soon. I hope things start to get better. I know I wish we could have quarantined together, but... I know this is safer. I want to make sure you're okay. So what have you been up to today? Well, besides working. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, my day's been pretty boring, too. I did read a little bit. Since quarantine, I picked up more reading. Look, I even made cute little tabs. <laughs> 
And then I watched a little TV. Oh, and get this. You're gonna be so proud of me. You're not gonna believe it. No, of course I did cleaning. I'm great at chores, thank you very much. <laughs> no, I actually did my taxes. I know by myself. How crazy, right? <laughs> Look at me. Hey, they're not gonna audit me. I'm sure I did great. I used TurboTax, it walked me through it. Yeah, it's almost disheartening though when you're doing your taxes and the little number in the top left keeps changing, like 2,000, 0, 3,000, negative 12. <laughs> yeah, maybe I am just doing something wrong. I know you said you were going to help me with it, but I didn't want to bother you, and I'm a big girl. I can handle it. <laughs> but yeah, so finally got those taken care of. And this is the latest I've ever done my taxes. <laughs> well, you know, taxes are the day before my birthday, so I typically have them done because I don't want to deal with it around my birthday, but since everything was extended, I waited a little bit. It was stressing me out too much to think about it. Did you get yours taken care of? That early? All right, all right, all right. I'll be better next year, I promise. Okay. But yeah. How's work going? Kind of boring. Yeah, there's not much to do when we're trapped at home, is there? And to think I used to say I was introverted. Boy, do I think I was wrong. I'm more outgoing than I thought I was. I just want to be around anybody. I used to make fun of those Zoom meetings at the beginning, but now I'm like desperately looking to have one with people. <laughs> hey, uh, they're not bad. Maybe we can get some of our friends together and do like a Zoom game party date night this weekend. I just need some social interaction. Yeah. Where I need to pick up a hobby. I know you keep telling me to try drawing. I even ordered a drawing pad and it came in the mail. I have it right here, but I tried, babe. I really did. I am not good at drawing at all. You're just trying to butter me up because you know I'm bored and alone. <laughs> I mean, I can try to draw you if you want me to draw you like one of my French girls. Okay, it may be corny, but honestly, if I tried to draw you, you'd literally look like a stick figure laying horizontally. I mean, I can give it a go, but if it stinks, I'm not going to show you. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. I have it right here. And look, it's got a cute little ladybug on the cover. <laughs> Maybe. You know me too well. I did maybe buy this one purely because of the cute little ladybug on the cover. <laughs> it was so cute. I named her Wilma. Wilma the Ladybug. 
good artists do. Haven't you seen movies? They like measure you all out with their fingers like this and then they go onto the paper like that. <laughs> How would you know who's the artist here? Me or you? <laughs> well, who has the drawing pad? Hold still. Okay. Hey, don't move. <laughs> All right. Just gonna do your cute little chin and your big old ears. <laughs> I'm just playing. They're not that big, Dumbo. <laughs> I'm just playing, I'm just playing. Or am I? <laughs> Next ear. And we have to make them a little crooked because... No, I'm just kidding. Alright, let's do your cute little nose. And your lips. Okay. Okay, and some eyebrows. Okay. Stop it. I'm being serious. I'm really trying to draw you right now. Okay. Babe, try and keep your eyes open. I'm drawing you. I know you're tired. I'll try to let you go to sleep after. Can I finish? I'm hurrying, I'm hurrying. I'll at least get the outline and then I can work on the details later. Oh, I know. I can work on it since I'm bored at home. And when quarantine's over, I'll give it to you as a gift. For all the time I missed you, I spent on this drawing. Okay? Okay. But, that means you can't see it right now, okay? If I show you now, I'm not giving it to you. Okay, you'll just have to be patient. It'll give you something else to look forward to. Okay. your hair. Okay. <laughs> Don't make fun of my concentration phase. Come on. Right. Okay. I think I got a pretty good outline. 
hold still. I'm just going to do a screenshot so that way I can keep looking at the photo later. Perfect. Okay. I'm going to set this over here in a pinky. I said I'm not going to show you right now. I got a screenshot, so feel free to move around now. And I did the outline, so I'll work on it later. Yeah, probably tomorrow. You look like you're getting tired. That's really sweet of you to try to stay up for me. I want you to, but it makes me feel bad. You look so sleepy. You're so sweet. How did I get so lucky? <laughs> well, let's see. I did try listening to some ASMR. It normally helps me, but I think I'm just missing you too much. I promise I did. Look, I even am using the cute little ghost case you got me for my AirPods, but look. See? They're dead, so... I can't really do anything till I charge them. I mean, I could listen to it out loud, but... You know I prefer ASMR with headphones. I just like that experience better. But to each their own. No, I can't really ASMR myself. I mean, have you ever tried? I can't really give myself tingles. See, like, this doesn't do anything. But I will say, the brush is very soft. <laughs> but this just makes me feel silly. Because I'm not doing makeup, I'm just like, oh yeah fluffy brush. I could do it for you now. How was that? I'm a natural. <laughs> Maybe I should start an ASMR too. Or you can. And then I can watch videos of you giving me ASMR. I like that idea. Yes, I am getting kind of sleepy. I knew talking to you would help me forget all about my anxiety. You're like magic when it comes to that. I don't know what I'd do without you. But I don't want to hang up the phone. Every time I hang up the phone, my anxiety comes back. It's just been too long. Really? You'd stay on the phone while I go to sleep? 
Are you sure? It's not going to like affect your minutes or your data? Babe. You're too good to me. Okay. Just this once. I'm sorry if I'm being clingy. I promise I won't make you stay on the phone with me tomorrow. Okay. I'll try and get some sleep. But don't go anywhere, okay? I'm watching you. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I'll go to bed, I promise. I love you. Good night.